Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video, and today we're bringing you guys episode number 20 of Hot Roulette. A pretty crazy milestone in this series. I just want to thank everybody for all the support on this, I guess, channel and on this series so far. We've been getting so many likes. Uh, the like to dislike ratio is absolutely crazy. And I just want to thank everybody uh, for watching this series so far. It's an absolute blast to make it. But anyways, we're going to get right into this video. And if you haven't watched the last episode, it is pretty crazy. All right. We did lose last game, which means we have to restart the buy now minimum. But the pickup last time definitely makes up for it. And uh, I'll show you guys here before we start up the game but we picked up Alexander Ovechkin that's pretty crazy he's playing on our first line left wing alongside with Bergeron and Patrick Kane I did put back on the captain card onto Patrick Kane there's a little bit of a mix-up between my pack squad series so I'll let you guys know how the pack squads is gonna work in my next episode in episode number two but that is how the first line is looking like it's a pretty solid lineup all right second line we got Rick Nash Logan Couture and James Neal really nice lineup there as well Third line, we got Blake Wheeler, Tyler Johnson, Gustav Nyquist. And on the fourth, we got Wayne Simmons, Brian Little, and Gabriel Landeskog. So that is how our offense is looking like. Let's go on to our defense here. And uh, on our defense, we got Garrison, Milestone Garrison, who's been absolutely lighting it up so far. Hopefully, we can see more from him. As well as Roberto Luongo, we got Cronwall. Uh, we got Hamilton, we got Mark Stahl, as well as Jack Johnson, Eric Johnson. And right now, Bobrovsky is tired, so we're giving, in, uh, Robert, we're giving Roberto Luongo a chance to play play as a starting goaltender for now so anyways let's get started into the first game let's see how we can do in the first game of this episode let's get right into it all right here we go guys first game of the episode he's got Zetterberg, Getzap, and Mike Bossy on his first line let's see what we can do in this game let's get it going Oh, that's going in. Oh, Bergeron threw the five hole, but just couldn't beat the post there. Still 0-0. We're getting a lot of pressure on him. Let's see if we can score a goal, though. Oh, there it is. Nice snipe. I think that's Logan Gator as well. And that makes it one to nothing. Just beating him far side, his goalie. And there we go. We got the lead. So let's try to keep it up. Nice little pass from James Neal across the boards. And uh, Logan Couture makes no mistake. Just kind of cutting right in front, beating Crawford. That's what I'm talking about. All right, let's keep it up. Oh, nice little passing play from Kane to Couture. And once again, we beat Crawford on the far side. That was just a nice little pa uh, cro or not cross crease, but nice little saucer pass right in front. And uh, Logan Couture tucks it in again for a second. Nice little saucer right through. And that's what I'm talking about. The captain card on Patrick Kane definitely got his uh, passing boost up or something. All right, two to nothing. Let's keep going. All right, end of the first period, guys, and we're playing pretty well. 9 to 4 in shots, 4 minutes time on attack to 1 minute. So we're almost quadrupling his time on attack. So we're playing pretty good so far. Just got to keep keep it up in the second period. Let's not lose the lead now. Oh, man, Blake Wheeler almost got by. Just going to tuck it in. All right, still 2 nothing. second period. Oh, nice goal there. Not some good defending by me. I kind of wanted just to switch to Garrison or to my other uh, forward back checking, but he kind of just sniped it on me, and he makes it 2-1, to one, breaking that shutout. Oh, man. Got to get a couple more goals, secure that lead just a little bit more. Oh, nice little backdoor pass, and Logan Couture with the hat trick. That is what I'm talking about. This line is just on fire. Brought him up from the fourth line up to the second. I mean, brought him up, yeah, brought him up from the fourth line to the second, and look at that. 
he is absolutely capitalizing on every single chance now. And there is three goals. So I don't know the exact rule. I have to read up on that. But I think Logan Gator gets something special as, uh, for that uh, hat trick for sure. So, anyways, let's keep it up. Three to one. Let's keep it going. All right, and that is the end of the game. Pretty hard fought game. Uh, we won with a score of three to one. Logan Gator scoring us three goals, which is pretty nice. So, anyways, let's take a look at the stats here. All right, so 21 to 26 in shots, uh, nine minutes, 40 seconds time on attack to four minutes and 51 seconds. So he definitely pelted me with shots, but Roberto Luongo uh, definitely bailing us out quite a bit on that game. Let's also take a look at the three stars there. Logan Tour with three goals. I just read up on the rules and it is a plus five all on him for three games. So I will be doing that as well as, well as Roberto Luongo getting the second star. And third star is James Neal, pretty much setting up Logan Tour most of the game. But that is pretty all right with me. So anyways, let's go into the marketplace. We're going to be raising that buy now minimum to 1k, choosing a 21st player. I'll meet you guys there. And welcome back to the auction search page. So the buy now minimum has been set. So let's go ahead into the marketplace and find the 21st player. So it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. That is actually a pretty decent pickup. Ryan Kessler, an 87 overall player, has some amazing face-offs. And look at that skating category as well. 90 skating. He's going to be an awesome addition to the team. So let's go ahead and buy him out and put him into the team. And there we go, guys. Ryan Kessler is now slotted into the third line center spot. I decided to move down Tyler Johnson down to the fourth, removing Brian Little from our team, kind of our small replacement. But our offense is looking a lot stronger with Ryan Kessler in there, although we kind of need some more defenders. doesn't really matter too much, but we're going to start into the second game here. Let's see what we can do in this next one. And the second game of the episode, we are facing a uh, Montreal Canadiens fan. He's got Kessel, Carter, and Pacioretty on his first line. Pretty nice lineup, but we're going to get this game going. Let's see what we can do. Oh, and there it is. Blake Wheeler on the shorthanded play, and he makes no mistake there. Kind of dragging it back. I don't know how he got through, but... Wheeler has the wheels, one to nothing. Pretty good start. Let's keep it up. Oh, and there it is, Alexander Ovechkin. I think that's his first goal. I'm not exactly sure, but a nice little uh, shot beating quick on the top left. Once again, our um, top left goals are just going in every single time. Alexander Ovechkin, nice little goal. Two to nothing, still in the first period. Let's keep it up. Oh no, I think that was a Vander Kane that slipped by the defenders and he just tucks it 5-hole on Roberto Luongo who's actually been playing pretty well, just got that one in and he makes it 2-1. Alright, can't lose any more goals, let's try to keep it going. And just like that, we are going into the second period, let's take a look at the first intermission stats, 10-6 in shots, 2 minutes 30 seconds time on attack to uh, 2 minutes and 16 seconds, so it's a pretty close game still. We're only leading with a margin of one. We got to keep going here. Maybe score a couple more goals. Try to get at least an insurance marker. Let's see what we can do in the second period. Oh my goodness. Logan Couture. He just keeps finding the back of the net. And there it is. Two goal lead now. We're beating him three to one. I don't know what Rick Nash did to get him that pass, but nice little setup by Rick Nash. And Logan Couture makes no mistake once again, just beating him across. Rick Nash, he was just standing right in the middle. Somehow I got to Couture. I'll take that goal any day. Anyways, 3-1. to one. Let's see what we can keep doing. Well, I think that's a penalty shot. Patrick King had the break. Let's see what we should do. Ooh, I think we should do the fake out. Maybe try the Datsuk. Let's see what we can do here. Try the Datsuk. No, oh, that didn't really work. But still, Patrick King tucks it in. 
I was trying to do it on the forehand, but he kind of just shot backhand and that still went in. All right, I'll take that goal. Four to one, second period, four minutes left. Oh, what a beautiful goal by Gabriel Landeskog, beating the defender, backhand, forehand, and he tucks it in by quick. Oh, man, that was a sweet little goal, not going to lie. All right, anyways, 5-1. to one. We're not going to watch the replay on that one. Let's keep it going, even though I think we should get the win here. Five minutes left in the third period. Oh, what a tip. Gabriel Landeskog again. Just after scoring the breakaway, he does a nice little tip goal against Quick, and we beat him 5 hole. Alright, we're blowing this game out. 6-1 to one now. Two minutes left. And there it is, guys. We win with a score of 6-1. to one. Very convincing win, if I say so myself. But there it is. We're going to be raising that buy now minimum to 2k. Let's, get, let's take a look at the stats before we do that. Alright, so the offense was definitely on fire. 26 to 14 in shots, 7 minutes and 52 seconds. Time on attack to 5 minutes and 45 seconds. So we played a pretty good game there. Three stars, Gabriel Landeskog with two goals. Patrick Kane with one goal, one assist, getting the second star. As well as Logan Couture getting one goal, one assist as well, getting that third star. So anyways, let's go ahead and go into the marketplace. Choose a 26th player. I'll meet you guys there. And welcome back to the auction search page, guys. We're going to be doing another pickup. Buy now minimum set to 2k because we are on a two-game win streak. So let's go ahead, choose a 26 player. Let's see what we get. It's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, Mike Green. Oh man, we got a little lucky not getting those bronze players right there. But Mike Green, a pretty solid right defenseman. He will play pretty well on our second or third line defender spot. So let's go ahead and buy him out, put him onto the team. Alright guys, so I'm pretty much just going to wrap up the episode here. Just going to show you where I put in Mike Green. And I did put him on the third line right defender spot. Taking out Eric Johnson. And now Mike Green is now playing alongside with Jack Johnson. And that looks like a lot more solid of a third line. So we're going to see how Mike Green plays in the next episode of Hot Roulette. So that is pretty much it guys. I also forgot to put in the plus 5 all for Logan Couture last game. So I guess I'll just put in the plus 5 all starting now. And he will get a plus 5 all for 3 games. Uh, so that will continue on to the next episode of Hut Roulette as well. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you guys did enjoy it, leave it a like. Also, if you have any line suggestions, once again, leave it in the comment box below or any suggestions to the series. But that is it, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Oh my goodness, come on. Shoot it! Oh, pass the glove, but you can't touch them for the white glove. There it is, Hoffman, wire it. Oh, Barlamo, another big team.